gifted piano man with a distinctive voice, Travis Rush knows how to connect with his audience. When putting together his sophomore album, he enlisted the fans to help select his first single. After weeks of voting, Travis and his team counted the votes and You'll Find Your Way was the fan favorite. As an added bonus, each fan that voted will have their name included in the CD booklet. We caught up with Travis at a local studio to check in on his new music. We're in the studio with Travis Rush. How are you? I'm good. Got a new single, a lot of exciting stuff yeah. going on. Let's talk a little bit about your single. Okay. You'll find your way? Yeah. It's a um, it's the new single. Just went to radio about uh, three weeks ago, and we got a music video for that. And um, it's kind of cool. The um, We let the fans vote on the single. So I actually put all the songs from the album up on the website and had the fans come in and vote and uh, at the end of the day, that was the song that they said they wanted to hear. So, And then not only did they select it, but you went back and put their names in the inside of the... Yeah, we, we uh, and actually we didn't tell them we were going to do that. We wanted them to do it just because they wanted to help. Everybody that, that went through from beginning to end and voted on every song through the whole process, uh, we listed them in the album as a special thanks for helping out with the project so that's yeah. really great what a great marketing idea because it is when you have loyal fans that are totally involved and then to include them in the thank yous well, that's, and, and, you that's know, a big deal for them to do it you know that's a lot of time and mm -hmm. and in order to vote you know we made them listen to the entire the, the way the program worked they had to listen to the whole thing so they had to listen to all 10 songs and i really appreciate it that's the bait of all your struggles through the rain of all your because you're from Oregon. Tell me a little bit about your background and where all this evolved and how long you've been doing music. And Okay, uh, that's a long story. <laughs> <laughs> um, I started when, uh, when I was a kid, obviously, playing in a little family band. You know, my dad, sister, and brother and I, we used to play uh, a lot of country music in, in the house, just in our own house. You know, mom was the audience. And um, so my dad played guitar and I played piano my whole life. Uh, actually, yeah, a piano player. So. Cool. Uh, it's my thing. I love, uh, you know, Billy Joel and all those guys. And then grew up listening to country music. And um, in Portland, Oregon is where I live um, part of the time. And then part of the time I'm in Nashville. And then I grew up in a town in southern Oregon called Gold Beach that uh, has about 1,576 people. You'll find your way. The album is called Feel. And, you know, all the songs talk about family and life and experience with relationships and uh, so for me it was more about just the, the concept of feeling emotions my previous album I um, wrote most of the music but this time we decided to uh, get music from writers here in Nashville and uh, it was just amazing the amount of great music that nobody has grabbed a hold of. So uh, yeah. had to set my ego aside and, <laughs> and 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 pick this stuff. It was such great music. So pick up some hidden treasures. Yeah. So who are some of the co-writers? Are the writers on the music that you have on your album? Um, we end, well, and you know that's kind of another interesting thing. We didn't ask for writers' names when we uh, picked the songs because we didn't want to be influenced. Oh, that's really so, cool. So uh, yeah, so we you know give all the songs a fair shot. We said okay, let's just get the music. We'll um, you know, rate everything based on the lyrics and the quality of the song. And uh, when it was all done, then we asked for writers' names. And uh, it's kind of funny, um, Neil Cody, who is a pretty well-known writer here, has uh, he actually wrote four of the songs in the end that we picked. <laughs> and You'll Find Your Way is one of them. Okay. And, uh, so you obviously liked his style yeah, well, and didn't even I, know you were picking his songs. That's cool. So I'm, I'm actually kind of excited at some point to hopefully write with him. And we seem to have the same taste. <laughs> Now, tell me where people can go and purchase your music and see more about you, your website, and so forth. It's uh, My website is travisrush.com, pretty okay. simple. And uh, the single right now is up on iTunes as well as the music video. Okay. And uh, then the album will be in stores, and they can also buy it directly uh, through the website as well. Don't forget those autographed discs we have up for grabs from Travis. To enter this week's drawing, all you have to do is email me your mailing address. 
That's Bailey at InsideMusicRow.com. If you want to get Inside Music Row on your mobile phone for the best in country music at your fingertips, just go to TrueCountry.tv and get the True Country channel. We're going to leave you with that fan favorite, You'll Find Your Way, from Travis Rush. Until next time, I'm Bailey for Inside Music Row, and I'll see you again real soon. You'll find your way Hey, auto work, I ain't blind I see you punching out for one last time Way to the world went on your mind But in the same, the end of the line today You'll find your way